If there's any hope that we're gonna get through this pandemic, it lies with the celebrities who always know what's best and are thankfully here to selflessly help just for help's sake, all without expecting anything in return, especially being congratulated or financially compensated for their good deeds. Matthew McConaughey posted this picture on his Instagram of him and his Ford F-150 King Ranch Edition packed with boxes with gigantic Ford stickers on them that contained masks which were created by Ford subsidiary Lincoln that he personally delivered to several hospitals. Their altruistic gesture made headlines across the country. Another celebrity saves the day. But nobody stopped to think why didn't the Lincoln Motor Company just ship the masks through UPS? Why did they need Matthew McConaughey to load up his truck and deliver them himself? Well, Matthew McConaughey is the spokesman of Lincoln. You may have seen him in their commercials over the years, and they figured with automobile sales down, they could get some publicity by having their celebrity spokesman deliver the free masks. But I'm sure if he wasn't their celebrity spokesman, he still would have done it out of the kindness of his own heart. Other celebrities like Alyssa Milano are showing off their homemade masks, like this one that she knitted, and these others she made for the kids while apparently forgetting about her poor hand-pecked husband. But she's really helping, tweeting, show me your masks, masks keep people safe and healthy, show me yours, ready, go! Maybe you should try this one on, Alyssa. It looks like it would fit you pretty well. Or better yet, why don't you do us all a favor and put this one on? And it's only a matter of time before we see celebrities posting selfies wearing their $115 Louis Vuitton designer mask. These are real, and you knew it was only a matter of time before designer masks went up for sale. I know it's a growing trend to shame people who are seen outside without their mask, and I think it's ridiculous, but I would be for shaming anybody wearing one of these. Others are giving words of encouragement to the graduating seniors of various colleges, like Brad Pitt. Hi everyone, Brad here from Quarantine, with a shout out to the graduating class of Missouri State University. Yeah! Must be very strange doing this in these trying times, but no, we're rooting for you. Our money's on you to make this world a better place, and we wish you all the best in your future endeavors. So, you did it. You made it. Enjoy, congrats again, and think big. Well, I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to have a career the way things were going, but I'm sure that everything will be just fine now. Thank you, Brad Pitt! Other celebrities, however, aren't doing so well. But thankfully, WebMD, the gigantic online health and wellness resource, is keeping tabs on which ones have come down with the coronavirus. Thank you, WebMD. This is some valuable information. I'm not sure what I would have done without it. Bernie Sanders is also seeking the wisdom of celebrities, interviewing some of them on his live streams. And you know, I'm just gonna go with Joe Biden because I cannot see the next the next step of America being ran by number 45. Like, I think, and I, and I don't know, you tell me, I think we are going to enter like a recession. You're real sharp, Cardi B. I was wondering what shutting the entire country down for two months was gonna do. But many in the liberal media are growing concerned that President Trump is handling the situation fairly well. There is politics involved. We have heard very little from, for instance, the more likely, most likely nominee of the Democratic Party, Joe Biden. He's having difficulty getting projecting through this crisis as the campaign goes totally on hold. And we're also seeing some polls indicating the president's uh, approval ratings among Democrats and independents skyrocketing to their highest levels yet. Well, uh, yes, I'm not sure what we're gonna do. Uh, I thought that this was going to end his presidency. You can hope, liberals, but we're gonna do everything that we can to get the president to second term because that's when the real fun is gonna begin. And help spread the word, I brought back my limited edition shiny mega country shirt and the silver silhouette shirt and the gold foil Trump 2020 shirts. They're available through Sunday, so get your orders in now, and if you haven't seen them, they all use a special shiny reflective paint that looks fantastic glimmering in the light. And like all of my designs, they're available to t-shirt, long sleeve, and hoodie, and a whole bunch of different colors as well. So head on over to markdice.com or click the link in the description below and check them out!